Hi everyone. Um, this is going to be a short weigh-in video because I don't have that much to say, but it is weigh-in day. It's Thursday. Um, today I weighed in at 188.0, um, which would be a gain of 2.6 from last week. Um, I don't know what to say. I did start my period yesterday, so I think that is a contributing factor. Um, you know, I always retain a little bit on my period. Although the last two times I had my period, I still lost weight, so I don't quite know what that's about. But I haven't been eating like any more salt. I've been drinking all my water. I've been eating within my calories with the exception of Sunday when I went to a barbecue, but I've done that before and lost weight. It's never been a problem before, so I don't quite know what to say. The only thing I know I could be doing more is exercising. Um, my plan was to start September 2nd exercising like regular, like I had done before. Um, God, I don't even know what stopped my exercising. California, I guess. After I came back from California, I really haven't been exercising since then. No, that's not true. There's something else. I forget. Well, anyway, sometime uh, at the beginning of August, I stopped exercising for a while. And um, since then, I just haven't been. And I don't know why I haven't been, but I just haven't felt the urge. Anyway, I was going to start this week, and I didn't because I got my period and I had cramps that went along with that for the first day. I sort of had cramps starting Tuesday and then Wednesday they were really bad and then I started my period and today the cramps are gone. But I have plans all night and I have a ton of work to do so I can't go to the gym today. So I guess starting next week I will start working out once my period's kind of getting over and I don't have so many plans um, and work to do. So I don't know. I, I'm disappointed. I'm really disappointed and I guess I'm just don't quite know what to say. Like, I've always either had a loss or had a really good reason for not having a loss. Like, uh, I ate poorly all week or I didn't exercise and, or I didn't even count calories because I was on vacation. Like, there's always been a reason and this time I've been within my calories, I've been eating really, really good food, like eating better than I normally eat and um, I had a gain. So I'm just hoping it's due to my period and after another week of eating healthy, no processed foods and having my period go away, I'll lose it again and be able to move forward from here. I hope it's not a plateau. It's very possible that I've hit a plateau. Um, but you'd think that a plateau is usually when you're staying the same weight even though you're eating fantastically and exercising. And when you're doing everything right, like everything you could possibly do right, all your water, all your sleep, all your exercising, all your food, and you're still not losing weight, that to me is a plateau. Like I feel like I can't classify it as a plateau because I'm not doing everything I could do, you know, to get out of it. So I don't know whether that makes a difference, but to me, it can't be a plateau, can it? I don't know. What do you think? Um, it's very possible, though, because in high school, I was 185, especially my soft, uh, no, my junior year of high school. I was 185, and I counted calories like a crazy person. And I went to the gym three or four times a week and worked out for an hour while I was there. I drove to the Y and worked out and then drove home. Plus, I was, like, in all this choir stuff and I was in theater and, you know, you're just up and about and moving and dancing and walking around and carrying things all the time. You'd think that on a calorie-restricted diet and working out as much as I was in high school, I would lose weight. And I didn't. I mean, for, like, six months, I maybe lost two pounds. And I really was eating well. I mean, I had my slip-up days. But right now, in this process on YouTube, I've had my slip-up days and I've still lost weight. I don't know. Either I didn't know what I was doing when I was younger and something was amiss and I can't think of what it is. Or 185 is just a weight that's really hard to get out of for my body. It's kind of what I'm thinking. Because also, back in 2005, when I was around 190 and I joined 24-Hour Fitness and I started working out like five or six days a week intensely for like an hour to an hour and a half every day. Like I was just crazy about working out. That was back when I really wanted to be a triathlete. And um, I was watching what I was eating very carefully and I only lost 10 pounds in four or five months. I went down to about 180, 175, 178, 180. I mean, and that was like really, really working out. So I don't know. I think Maybe, maybe this is all bullshit, maybe I'll break through it in the next month, but I feel like maybe 
I'm at a weight where my body doesn't want to let go of more. Especially since I've really not been much lighter than I am now as an adult. It may be that just going into that virgin weight territory um, is like the body needs some resetting time. Now I'm just blathering. But I'm sort of mist baffled and mystified by the fact that I gained two and a half pounds this week and did things right. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Anyway. So, hooray, buente, not so good. Um, I mean, I'm not like super upset about it. I'm fine, whatever. My life is really good right now, so all things considered, I'm doing very well. But since this is a video about my weigh-in, I happen to be very disappointed about that. Yeah. So, we'll see. Uh, next week I'm going to start exercising. And I know I've been making these I'm gonna, I'm gonna videos, but anybody who knows me knows I do what I say I'm gonna do, always. And, um, so I am going to start working out next week, and that'll have been like a week on a no-processed diet, which I'm loving, by the way. Really loving. I'm, I feel a response in my body, which is positive, so. I guess we'll see. If by this time next month, if by the beginning of October I have not lost weight, with working out and eating a no-processed diet, uh, then I can probably think I'm going to plateau and I'm going to have to really try hard to work through it. But in the meantime, we'll just hope this is the this week thing and it's not going to last. Okay? So, happy weekend. I don't know if I'll make a video tomorrow. I've got quite a bit going on between now and Sunday, so I will talk to you later. Bye.